Hey Jess. <clears throat> Sorry, it's so dark. Just got home. Anyways, um, I love, 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 loved your video. Um, your art is amazing. I love your ceramics. Like, I just, oh, I love the Rapunzel one so much. Um, I love all of your ceramics. I always have. And I'm sure I would love your watercolors. And you know it. You've shown me some of them and you're really good at it. And I have no patience for watercolors, so I admire you for that. And so don't even be shy about it. Ever. Ever. Okay. Anyways, um, I wanted to show you some of my prints, but first, I don't know if you can see it. This is a really, it's actually a really brightly colored painting that I'm working on, but you can't tell. Oh wait, maybe if I sit down here, you'll be able to see me. There I am. Yay. Some water. Mm. And a cat. She's purring. Oh, because she, she knows I'm talking to you and she misses you too. <laughs> okay, so first I want to show you two things. One is something that is amazing for two reasons. It's small and it makes me think of you. And you know why. The other is amazing because it just is a thimble. <laughs> the third is, yes it's kind of messy, oh shit, the light went away, but not messy for me, that's pretty clean. So here is a line of cut I did and you've probably seen it before. Lino cut is a linoleum print, and I'll, I was, I'll go into it, but I, I, I already made a video going into it, and it was too long, and it cut me off, and it, whatever. This is another lino cut. <coughs> I need some weird wood green. It's, it's the linoleum, and you can actually, it's the easiest one you could do without a press, and I'll tell you about it, and you can do it at home. Yes. Okay, and then these are just, you know, you'll see my own cut, but, but playing with color. You can't really see it that well. And yeah, you know, there's a couple more, but you don't really care to see them, right? It's just all yellow and green, but different variations. And then this is a copper plate. Etch. You take a copper plate and you put a hard ground on it, and then you kind of take these tools to draw out the hard ground and etch it at, you know, certain times, whatever. And this is mine. You can't really see it that well. It's like a lot of little lines you can't see in this video. Um, yeah, it's weird. Whatever. This sign is borders, and I'll go on that too. Into that if you want me to later. And this is an aqua tent, and it's another copper paint print making technique. This is my BAT, and it's a fancy French or Italian word that means like, I don't even, I can't even see it. And um, it basically means I'm ready to pull an edition, but I haven't made an edition. And um, so a BAT means that it's ready to pull, ready to pull. Exciting stuff, huh? And then I have this which is 
that one that you kind of saw already and it's a test print of um, monotype layers and layers. Each color is a different layer of monotype and there's like four different layers and this is just a test and then photocopy print on that. So that's what I've been doing. I mean, nothing fancy, nothing amazing. Um, this is a painting that, whoa, whoa, that I'm working on. Um, it's acrylic actually, so they're doing, um, oils, you know, but then I, I kind of went back to my roots and want to do some acrylic and the coloring is actually way better. It's just that that light is behind it. Um, but you know, you know how my color and my work, it's kind of crazy. And I, sorry, my video is so lame compared to yours, but seriously, like, I think you just made my whole life posting that video, like, so hilarious, so hilarious. Just like, so you, and I miss you so much. Kinda sucks. We're gonna be moving back soon, so that's good. Um, yeah. I think I just made the weirdest video ever. But I hope you have a good night and make me another video soon, because I'm gonna be making you one. <laughs>